I'll take the big room playing our So That Holiday Show tonight at DLC. This is all yours, the latest on Atlantic Records. Uh, <laughs> in reading up on what you guys have been up to, I was greatly amused and inspired by the show you played in Iceland. Mm. <laughs> Could you talk about that? Because that just sounds like such a... When you're in a band, you have to be open to the idea that weird things are going to happen. Yeah, well, um, a lot of the time in bands you get offered sort of so-called uh, like corporate gigs where companies pay you to do normally a small show, pay you a lot of money to a small show for a sort of small group of people, and you know, you sort of go, well, this seems like kind of a lame thing to do, but it's a lot of money. In this case, it was not a lot of money, but a very cool opportunity to go to Iceland and play for... Um, a load of Russian uh, like telecoms managers or something, wasn't it? And they uh, had like a Viking feast, and we had to dress up as Vikings <laughs> and play our songs to a load of 150 Russian phone guys who didn't know who we were. Um, but it was really fun, and you know, I think we just kind of thought, well, let's just go for it. You know, it's uh, it's a laugh, and no one's ever going to find out about this except that obviously we must have talked about it at some point because now we're talking about it now. So there you go. It was it was it was worth it. We had a good time. Russians on a business trip to Iceland, and not Reykjavik, you were out in the middle of nowhere. It was out in the sticks, yeah. There were no yeah. means of escape, right? No, no, no. And it, it was very cold. <laughs> very cold, and they were all wearing those horned hats and yeah. fur. Yeah, and we eating, were, they were, everyone was. Yeah. Eating with their hands, and yeah. probably lots of yeah. vodka. And A lot of mead, I don't know, mead or wine, or, yeah, vodka probably, yeah. It was, it, was, it was pretty unforgettable. I should say so. I've got such a great picture in, yeah. in my mind. I've got some great pictures on my phone. So. <laughs> well, I want to take a look at Outstanding. So uh, if the Russian telephone company calls again, would you... Uh, maybe maybe a, a warmer place? Bahamas this time or something? That would be good. Yeah, maybe wear some grass skirts or something. <laughs> All right, so uh, another thing was... Uh, I'm looking for closure on this story because I, I saw on Twitter many months ago that Aaron Paul from the greatest TV show ever made, Breaking Bad, tweeted that he was a fan and invited you to play at his house, speaking of different gigs. Did that ever happen? Did you meet? What happened? We met, we met at Lollapalooza. Uh, he was, we were playing on stage and he was on like, stage right just next to me and I sort of was on stage doing, doing my thing. I sort of looked over and saw him literally doing a kind of literal double take. Like, <laughs> and he was like, hey man, go on, keep playing. So we met him afterwards, he was very nice, we haven't been to his house yet, it's just always so hard to, he's busy and we're busy and you know, whenever we're in LA he seems to be out doing something and maybe he's just lying. But uh, <laughs> no, I think it will, it will happen at some point, you know, even if it's just to go around and look at how big his house is or something. I'm sure it's huge. I'm sure it's were you fans of the show? Are you fans of yeah, the show? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We watched, well, I watched it all on a tour of the States about two years ago and it was, it was great. I was kind of watching it like right up until going on stage time. It was like, Gus, come on seriously, we've got to go on stage now. <laughs> Yeah. Better Call Saul begins in February, too. Really? Yeah. All right. Something to watch yeah. early next year when you're out and about. You have a lot more dates, Good stuff. including Madison Square Garden in New York on March 30th with Fantagram. Yeah. That should Outstanding. Be sick. All right. It should be. And no Viking hats. No, uh, well, you never know. Well, it could be. All right. One more song. We'll turn you loose. This is all yours, the latest from Raul J on Atlantic Records. And you can see him again tonight live at our Sold Out Holiday Show at the LC. Thanks for coming in, guys.